After leaving Bathurst, where we'd changed engine crews, we started the climb of the famous Tamula Bank. Tamula Bank is probably the worst climb on the western side of uh, New South Wales, and one which we had heard a great deal about. And although one had seen film and pictures of Tamula Bank, there's nothing like first hand experience to drive things home. When we left Bathurst, the fire uh, was in a real mess, having suffered further from the damage that had occurred in the early part of the climb of the Blue Mountains. The new crew at Bathurst were obviously very experienced men, and in fact were quite amazing, surprising to me because one was 64 years of age and one was 63 years of age. The 63-year-old man drove the locomotive and the 64-year-old did the firing. At this stage, I would estimate that the fire was a foot thick of ash with four inches of fire on the top of that. The whole thing was level with the fire hole door and to get more coal in, it needed to be put into the fire hole door and then pushed in. Our steam raising capacity was down around the 150 pound mark, as in fact can be seen by the strength of the exhaust when compared to that of the 38. I was full of admiration for the Bathurst firemen who worked unstintingly during this climb to try and pull the fire round. And in fact, before we reached the top of the climb, he had made the engine blow off steam. And it is evident throughout the climb that the Scotsman's exhaust beat is getting stronger and certainly towards the top can be seen to be doing some real work. <laughs> 